the SAT is changing and students love that it's now an hour shorter and has no long reading passages. You see, the previous SAT was over three hours, while the new SAT, which we kind of refer to as the DSAT for digital SAT, comes in at just over two hours. And while the old SAT used to throw five super long reading passages at you, they've now changed it. So now you just read a paragraph for each question. And there's no more of that sort of zoning out on long reading passages like we were used to seeing before. While those are the two changes that students are most excited about, there are others as well, including that the SAT is now digital on your computer or tablet. This means that the days of paper and pencil SAT testing are now over and every student preparing for the SAT needs to download the SAT's Blue Book app and bring their laptop or tablet to the testing center so they can take the official test on their device. By going digital, the SAT has unlocked the ability to become adaptive, meaning that they'll give everyone the same first module one for the reading and writing half, but now you'll get either a harder or easier module two based on how you did in that module one. And this is true for module one and two in the math. So basically we wanna do as well as we can on that first module, that way we get the harder second module that's gonna open up the highest possible score for us. Finally, the last major change is the renewed emphasis on vocabulary. While the latest version of the SAT only had a few vocab questions per test, students can expect many more on this new digital SAT. And there's a couple other smaller changes too, like students will get results faster in a few days instead of a few weeks, and they'll get to use their calculator on both of the math sections instead of there being a no calculator math section like there was before. All that aside, overall, what I want you to know is that the DSAT is, in my opinion, a better test. That's designed to make the testing experience a lot better for students.